I know I didn't vlog really yesterday. Well, okay, I kind of take that back. So, last night I did vlog a little bit, but I was just in and out of sleep last night, and I didn't vlog very much that I was like, I'm not even going to worry about it. Like I was saying last night, I came home from church, and I was just working on some stuff, like, because I have people coming over tonight for dinner, so I'll talk about that in a sec. But, um, anyways, like I was saying, I have people coming over tonight for dinner, so I came home from church, and I was getting the apartment all picked up and stuff. I mean, there wasn't a whole lot, because, I mean, granted, I had the apartment pretty clean, so I wasn't worried about it. Then I was watching TV, and I fell asleep, and I was, like, in and out of sleep for like about a half an hour, and then I finally conked out around, like, 8, and I was sad, and was asleep for a good, like, two, three hours, which is weird because I had slept really well the night before, so why the fact I was so tired, I don't know. So then I woke up about midnight, and then I couldn't, like, actually go back to sleep, so, which you go figure, right? And so, last night I also hand washed my bras, or, well, the bras that I wore this last week, because normally I do those on Monday when I do my laundry, and me and my roommate are kind of funny because we hang dry our bras out in the family room on the chairs because there's just no circulation in our bathrooms that they would just take forever to dry because I have people coming over tonight, so I didn't want my bras hanging out in the family room with my friends coming over. Also, because I am going to my parents this week, I'm trying to get my laundry done before I go to my parents this week. Yeah, I'm going off on a tangent. <laughs> so, again, I didn't sleep very well last night, and, uh, anyways, I'm actually going to be getting up and getting ready for work soon, but my bed is so comfy, I just don't want to get up. <laughs> I just got out of the shower, and before I go to work, I am going to do my laundry, and yeah, so that way that can be all ready to hang dry when I get home from work today. And um, turn on the lights. <sighs> Putting in my pods and I have, I'm washing my towels today too. So my load is going to be extra big today. And part of the reason why I'm washing towels is because, like I said, I have guests coming over today. So I want clean towels in the bathroom for them to wash their hands and, you know, all that jazz. Awesome. So that's all done. I'm going to finish getting ready for the day. What time is it? It's like 6.30, 7. It's 6, only 6.30. Sweet. I still have time. So I'm going to make my bed. And I'm thinking about maybe doing a little bit of makeup today. Hey guys, I'm on my way to work. <clears throat> I'm starting my new shift today. So... I'm going a little bit early, so hopefully we'll see if I can clock on. It'll be really nice. Like I said earlier, did not sleep very well, so I'm just like, oh, really? I really wish that I had gotten more sleep last night. I'm starting, sorry, I'm making sure a pedestrian wasn't crossing the street. I really hope I don't get into that schedule of not sleeping when I should be sleeping. And falling asleep early 
I need to like not get into that habit because there was like a what a couple of months ago or so that I really got into that type of schedule and it was it took me a while to get out of that like I said it's really weird because whoa dude are you stopping you know and it was just weird because I got had gotten good sleep the night before so I don't know why I was so so I'm on my lunch and I just ate out work because I'm kind of uh, don't have a whole lot of money to spend until next payday, which is the 10th oh, car. So yeah, work has been really good today. Um, nothing out of the ordinary, which is always good. It's really cold today. And... Ugh. Whoosh, and it's windy but yeah like I said I'm just gonna go get something to drink and eat and yeah I need to get gas after work today but uh, maybe I'll do that in between van runs I don't know we'll see Unfortunately, like I showed you, they didn't have strawberry Fanta, but whatever, it's all good. But, um, so I got a root beer instead, but I was hoping for a nice strawberry Fanta. I'm headed back to work, and I'm gonna drink this, and I bought some cupcakes as well. You know what I do usually on Mondays. It's kind of like a routine. So, as always, I'm on my way to the school. Oh my gosh, I'm so ready for this day to be over. I'm so tired. Like I mentioned, I did not get very much sleep last night and oh, I'm just exhausted. And tonight I'm gonna have to try and find a empty parking spot because so that way the people that are coming over tonight can be able to just park in my spot. But I'm praying that there's a parking spot available i'm just i'm like i said i'm so tired i don't even know how much sleep i got last night i think i probably got a total of maybe about maybe four if even that like three or four i think those three hours were like completely inconsistent too they weren't just three straight hours it was you know here and there here and there so i'm just so tired okay i'm gonna go meet the kids Ugh, the bell just rang, so I gotta go. Oops, I didn't even lock my door. Ugh. So, I just dropped off my first group of kids, and now I am going to. Oh, my eyebrows look horrendous right now. You know what? I did not put um, gel in it to keep it in place, so, oh my gosh, my brows look terrible right now. And then my eyeliner and shadow is just looking horrible right now. Ah! Oh my gosh. And then my foundation is obviously wearing off, so I think I'm going to have to redo my makeup before Maria and James come over tonight. But anyway, I, like I said, just dropped off my first group of kids, and now I'm going to work on some editing. Hopefully you can get this vlog um, edited all the way up to this point before I, like, fall asleep, or hopefully I won't fall asleep today. But anyway, yeah, I'm going to work on editing. Alright, so I got part of the vlog uploaded, and now I'm going to go meet the other group of kids, and then head back to the center. I don't know if uh, Busy Body's supposed to be here today or not. I don't know. So I am done with my van runs and I'm headed back to work. I'll probably send a teacher home. But I don't know if I mentioned this, um, but I am working tomorrow morning at 7 to 4. So I know I'll be able to just go home after my van runs. So that is always good. Anyway, we'll see what time I go home today, especially because like I said, I started work at 7.30 today. If van runs went good today. My first group, there was another little 
stinker who was just had to keep on telling that child to okay have a seat you know stop and that child was just having a hard time today but my 3:30 van run as usual there was a staff member that was helping with um, the busy body child that child actually did pretty well today um, like I said it just helps so much when they have a staff member help me watch this child because it just lets me um, be able to focus on the other kids and not have to focus on that child and worry about that child running off you know like I've, I've mentioned that before but anyway yeah so van runs went good today I just actually saw one of my co-workers driving that way anyway um yeah I'm headed back to the center and we'll see what time I get off work so I am home and I am just putting up my laundry so it can dry and I am just getting finishing getting last minute stuff ready for James and Maria to come over tonight and I believe it's just James and Maria but I I again don't 100% no. Anyways, yeah, so I'm just hanging up my laundry and uh, getting some stuff done before James and Maria come. Hey guys, so I just got off the phone with Maria and her and James are on their way now. And I guess since we don't have a whole lot of time to hang out because um, Tim is picking up Maria at like 9.30 and it's 7 o'clock now. And so we just figured by the time we cook dinner and everything, we wouldn't have a whole lot of time to really just hang out. So I guess we're going to get takeout. And I was like, well, I don't have a whole lot of money because I have like 40 bucks to my name until next payday. <sighs> but I said, whatever, that's fine. I don't care. <laughs> but anyway, nothing super exciting going on right now. I'm just actually watching... I've heard this on some of my old vlogs. <laughs> and it's interesting watching vlogs because it kind of, you know, makes you remember those memories, I guess. And this day, um, was, I don't remember, was a crazy, crazy ask day. Um, yeah, it was busy with work. And then I remember... Um, I was trying to get gas, and there was people that were trying to, like, get to the pump where I was wanting to get to, and, yeah, so that was a, that was an interesting vlog. <laughs> but anyway, uh, I, I know I've mentioned this before, and I, I know I've mentioned this in a recent vlog, too. It's just very interesting looking back at your old vlogs, like, just remembering that day, and, like, ah, <laughs> But yeah, so like I said, James and Maria are on their way and we're going to go get, um, what are we getting? I think they wanted to go get like teriyaki. But yeah, so I'm just, like I said, patiently waiting for them. <sighs> okay, so this has been one of the most crazy interesting nights ever. Okay, so <sighs> James and Maria ended up coming here. And we weren't here for very long, and then we went and got food. And then we went to a couple of different places to get food. And then we went back to James's house, and then we weren't even there for, like, maybe 20 minutes. And then Tim came and picked up Maria and I and dropped us off. And then I get home and I realize, oh, my gosh, I don't have my cell phone. And then, so Maria went and called t James, and, they said, and he had it. But then... As they were gone, I noticed that my car keys are missing because, again, you know how I keep my car keys separate from my thing. I'm actually going to go look at my car make sure I didn't lock them in my car. Oh, my gosh. Sorry. I got cut off because James called me. My keys were in his car. They fell out of my pocket. I'm so mad. And I feel bad because he has to drive over here. I mean, luckily, he's not that far away. But, oh, gosh. This has been one of the most annoying nights ever. So I'm going to go and wait for James. It won't be too long. What a night. Yeah. <laughs> so, like I was saying. <sighs> okay, so here's what, they got, what happened. James dropped Marie off for a few minutes because he wanted to go back to his place and let the dog out and stuff. 
And then he came by, and then we were just kind of watching TV for like maybe about 15 minutes, if even that. And then, oh my gosh, I'm so out of breath because I'm just so, that was just so annoyingly stressful. Anyway, um, then they, we kind of all decided what we wanted to do for dinner. And James and Maria ordered food. I wasn't planning on getting anything because, like I said, I don't have a lot of money to my name right now until next payday. And anyway, so we went and get, got their food. And then we stopped at Baskin Robbins because James wanted a drink that they had there. And then Maria was like, D are you sure you don't want anything? Because I don't want to eat be eating in front of you, you know, but and I was like, okay, well, if you're sure, so I went and got myself some McDonald's, so he did, like, three separate stops, and so by the time we got back to James's house, it was, like, 8 30, and we were eating our dinner, and then Tim showed up, and so I was, like, feeling, like, kind of rushed, because, J um, because Tim was giving me a ride back home, so that way James didn't have to, and anyway, I get home, and I realized, Holy crap, my phone is missing. And so Maria was like, okay, well, I'll go call downstairs and call James. And I was like, okay. And so I'm like searching for my keys. And then I see that Maria and Tim just disappeared. And I was like, holy crap. I don't know if they have my phone. Like, what the heck? So then they come back and she's like, yes, they have. He had your phone. And so then I was like, oh crap, because I couldn't call James. To let him know, hey, also look to see if you have my car keys, too. And then, so then when I finally got my phone, I called James, and he's like, are you kidding? I was like, no, and I feel so horrible. And he's like, so he went out and looked at his car. He's like, yep, they're there. I was like, oh, shoot. And he's like, do you not have a hair spare set? And I was like, uh, I, I don't, because my parents have the spare set, so I do need to make a spare set for here. But I was like, no. So then I felt bad because then he's like, okay, well, I'll bring him over. And I felt really bad because he was already, like, pretty much almost ready for bed and stuff. And I was like, oh, gosh. I just felt horrible. I So, anyway, but he was, like, cool, totally cool about it. He just dropped him off and he's like, don't even worry about it. You, It's not like you were very far. I was like, oh, gosh. I'm about ready to cry. That was just so annoyingly stressful, and I feel so bad that I had to make Tim, Maria, and James do all that for me. And I was telling James, like, the one time I didn't check to make sure I had my cell phone, my keys, my wallet. He always says, before I always leave, cell phone, keys, wallet. Yes, yes, yes. And normally, like, I would know that I didn't have my keys because, lo and behold, I, I drive to James's house. And so I would have known that I didn't have my keys right away. But I didn't drive to James's because we all rode in James's car to go do all the food pickup and stuff. And so I left my car here. So I, it was stupid. I didn't even need to bring my car keys. And I was stupid and I did. And what I should have done is attached them to my regular keys because I knew I wasn't going to need them. Oh, gosh. Anyway, that was just so ridiculously stressful. I, thank you, James, Marie, and Tim for... Coming to my rescue tonight. Gosh. By the way, I need to call Maria because she needs. I need to let her know if James had my keys. Gosh. I'm like about ready to cry. This I feel so bad. I feel so bad. Anyways, I am going to call it a night because this night could not get any worse. Anyways, I will see you guys tomorrow. Don't forget to like and subscribe. Bye.